My name is Florenda. I'm a Christian. And I have followed all your talks. And uh, I really admire um, listening to you regarding, you know, I mean, comparison between Christianity and Islam. It's my pleasure to ask you a question. Actually, um, a while ago, it was uh, asked regarding the judgment day or the second coming. Um, I believe that Christian and Muslim believe on that, and uh, both religions are preparing on the judgment day. Um, I have a friend who is a Muslim, and he always uh, told me that I'll be safe in Islam. Now, I wanted to ask you, What's the difference between, you know, um, preparation of Christian and the Muslims to be safe in the second life and how you will encourage me to embrace Islam? Sister, the difference between a Muslim and a Christian preparing for the second coming of Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, and the day of judgment is the Christian is waiting for Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, as almighty God to come. We Muslims are waiting that he will come and clarify that he is not God. He will come and follow the commandments of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Because Jesus Christ said in the Gospel of John, chapter number 16, verse number 12 to 14, I have many things to say unto you, but you cannot bear them now. For he, when the Spirit of truth shall come, he shall guide you unto all truth. So Jesus Christ said about the coming of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So if I have to help you, I will tell that follow the teachings of Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, and believe in Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Only if you believe in Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, will you be safe on the day of judgment. So to help you, I would say that besides believing in Almighty God, you have to believe that Jesus is a messenger of God, and you also have to believe that Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, is a messenger of God, sister. Sister, do you believe that there is one God? Yes. Do you believe Jesus is God or is he a messenger? Messenger. Do you believe Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu is messenger? Yes. So that means you are a Muslim sister. <laughs> Would you like to say it in Arabic? Uh, yes. I'll just repeat the kalma in Arabic and you can repeat it. Ashadu. 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 Allah. Allah. Ilaha. Allah. Illa Allah. Illa Allah. Wa ashadu. Wa ashadu. Anna. Anna. Muhammadan. Abduhu, Abduhu. Wa I bear witness I bear witness I bear witness bear witness that that there is no God there is no God but Allah but Allah and I bear witness and I bear witness that that Prophet Muhammad, Prophet Muhammad is, is his messenger, his messenger and, servant of God. and servant of God. And servant of God. MashaAllah. Jadakallah, sister. May Allah reward you. May Allah accept your efforts. And inshallah, inshallah, I pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that may he save you from the hellfire and may he grant you Jannah on the day of judgment. Inshallah. I began yesterday here with a question which was rightly answered, but with some other questions in mind. I could not accept Islam till all such questions have been answered. So it's a privilege once more again today to bring before the audience this one more question, after which I'm going to declare my intentions and my view of Islam.